Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu was admitted to the hospital on Saturday and diagnosed with dehydration, according to his office, which also said the 73-year-old leader was experiencing dizziness but was in good condition. He is staying there overnight, though there was no indication of a potential handover of power. Netanyahu's potential absence raised questions as the country deals with a crisis over a planned judicial overhaul, as well as simmering conflicts with the Palestinians and Iran. He moved to calm worries by issuing a brief video message reportedly from his hospital room near Tel Aviv. In it, he says he feels well and advises those watching to, quote, spend less time in the sun, drink more water, and may we all have a good new week. Netanyahu, Israel's longest serving leader, said he had been on holiday at the Sea of Galilee on Friday during a heat wave. Temperatures there reached 108 degrees Saturday. His office said Netanyahu was admitted on his physician's recommendation after complaining of light dizziness and initial tests came back normal. The prime minister's office said Sunday's scheduled cabinet meeting would instead be moved to Monday. Meanwhile, thousands of Israelis continued to hit the streets to protest the proposed changes to the country's judiciary, which they fear will limit court independence. Netanyahu, who is on trial for corruption charges that he denies, says the reforms would balance out branches of government.